oh, you don't know how <clears throat> how spicy this is. sauce in. It's not the spicy sauce, it's all in one. All the flavors are in this sauce. Oh my god, I, I can't talk. I think I'm gonna get some milk. Okay, continue. Oh, I really don't know if I can finish this whole bowl. my breakfast today the black stuff is from the black sesame blend um, and as usual I have some fruits in there too hey guys it's bedtime talk again um, I came to bed earlier today because I'm developing a headache probably due to too much screen time during the day and I forgot to take breaks in between I actually plan to work on my own personal project but now um, I don't really want to force my brain to work on it any longer I probably will listen to some podcasts or read a book 
or just listen to some YouTube video while resting my eyes. Mm, yeah, I might sleep earlier tonight just to get a better rest so I can be more productive tomorrow. I was a little bit ambitious at the beginning of this week, thinking that I might be able to finish my personal project. Another one, not the time zone app, but a different one. But it seems like the project is also more complicated than I thought. And so far, I haven't been giving out enough time to this project. So it might be tough to complete it by the end of this week. I probably will extend the deadline to the end of next week. I might have more schoolwork coming as well. So we'll have to plan again by this weekend and see how things go. And I'm going to have classes this whole weekend. So very excited about that. Just a quick report guys. I know that I said earlier that I wouldn't do anything related to my project or um, anything brain intensive but good news I did finish something for my personal project um, yeah I think I'm gonna show you what this project is gonna be like maybe soonish yeah for now I'm gonna keep it as a secret <laughs> This week, I've been watching a very trending Chinese TV show. It was recommended by my friends, but I've been loving it because I resonate with it so much. It's a story of three women of age 30 living in Shanghai. They have different personalities and are at different stages of their lives, but they are all standing crossroads, making important decisions and striving to make better lives for themselves. What's special about this show is that it is so true to the reality that a lot of people, not only Chinese people, um, resonate so much with the main characters. It also brought back many of my old memories, which I haven't accessed for a long time. If you're interested to know how women over 30 live their urban lives in China, um, or just simply some Chinese culture, like what urban lives look like in China, I've left a link in my video description to the TV show with English subtitles. On a similar note, I feel really lucky to have received so many messages from videos, shows, and articles about how women in their 30s are still working their ass off to achieve their dreams. They give me tremendous hopes and courages. So as part of the 30-year-old's family, I feel my best years are yet to come. But seriously, I've also been thinking about what our lives should be about. Um, I mean, I don't think it should be only about financial achievements, um, but a higher goal behind that. To me, money is just a means to achieve something more profound. Otherwise, it will become meaningless after we earn a certain amount. Have you thought about this, guys? So what's your take on this? I'm curious. I'm not going to film my face today anymore because <clears throat> my eyes are very puffed. <laughs> I just finished my lunch. Um, I had avioli and that's it. <laughs> Hello everyone, it's already Sunday afternoon. I finally finished my weekend classes as well as its presentations and final exams. Um, but I've already got pretty good feedback from the professor, which I'm very happy about. However, this is not the end of this trimester yet. I still have two final papers to write and one more final exam waiting for me two weeks from now. But yes, I'm at the closing chapter of this trimester. <laughs> So in conclusion, this weekend is kind of tiring. I actually was preparing for my presentation until 1 a.m. But it's such a good feeling after the final exam. <laughs> so after editing and publishing this video, I can finally relax for a few hours <laughs> by the end of this week. Actually, I might relax a little bit more tomorrow. So tomorrow will be part of my Sunday, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Before I leave, I'm going to do another Japanese and French report. Japanese. Sun. Hi. Ohayo. Mm. French. Salut. 
Comment ça va? Ça va très bien. Et toi? So this is it. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and I really appreciate it as always. Take care and I'll see you next week.